Go ahead up morning guys, welcome to today. Welcome to the day after the horse show. Let me tell you, horse shows, the day after the horse shows we usually rest, but not today. They all wanna go in. They're like, let's go. <laughs> let's go to the barn. We got Brooklyn and we got Zoe. Zoe, our goose. <laughs> she comes everywhere with us. Come on, we got all the dogs. And we got Duck, and Duck grew. Show them, hold her up. She's like triple the size. Nana, what's your name? This one, Lucy. Lucy Goosey. Oh my gosh. No. That would have been perfect, but Sophie named her Zoe. <laughs> Lucy Goosey, I love that. Anyway, we are headed out for a quick stroll on the property. Jacob wants to explore I Nana's new farm. Goose. I think I kicked the goose. Don't kick the goose. Well, she went between my legs. I've also been trying to scoop up all this hay because stop chasing her. it's straw, but I don't know. I just can't. I have to get it out of here. People are suggesting that we use uh, one of these things to feed our horses in. This is like the perfect size, the perfect shape, the perfect everything. I'm gonna clean this out. That's gonna be our first feeder on the Day by Day new farm. Come on, let's go. Another goose, you should name it Lucy Goosey. Lucy Goosey is the perfect name. You're or just Lucy and oh. its nickname, nick, nickname can be Lucy Goosey. Lucy Goosey. You already have someone named Lucy. We're, this is Lucy Goosey and this is Zoe Zucky. No, Zoe Ducky. No, I don't know. <laughs> Let's go. That's Zoe. And this it's is way too early. Way too early for long walks on the property. <laughs> Jacob needs to get burn off some energy. So do the dogs. They were at home all day yesterday without us. I felt so bad for the goose because my son comes and takes care of the dogs when we're gone for a long time. But he, I didn't ask him to take care of the goose because I didn't think he would understand or appreciate her as much as we do. Come on, follow Zoe. She follows people. Don't chase the goose. Ruby, Ruby, go. But anyway, it rained all night. We lost Daisy already. Daisy is addicted to the road now that she discovered. Uh, Ruby, no. Zoe's coming with you. Zoe. Zoe doesn't want to go with the dogs. Take so take her with you. Okay, Sophie's got it. Oh my gosh, chaos at every turn, you guys. She's coming. Don't get too far ahead of her, Sophie. There's a lot happening on a day by day farm. But before we get started in today's video, Jacob wants to explore this property. He wants to go into our haunted barn. Open Sesame. Come on, it's just a fun trail. Open Sesame Street. Ellie is a mess. <laughs> We did not tell the grandkids we moved farms. I already knew. But they saw the video, so Brooklyn already knew. I saw the video. Brooklyn saw the video, but they weren't sure. So last night, or the other night when they came, we surprised them with moving to a new farm. And they were super excited. Brooklyn said, what did you say? I said, um, before we got here, I said, wait, is this a house? Yeah. And then I was like, uh, I don't know. And I said, and she said, had had why would you know and I said because I had snoop on your guys's channel and I saw a thing show and it said showing our dogs our yeah, new farmhouse yeah. yeah and then she said did you like the farm yeah. what did you yeah. say grandchild approved. grandchild approved okay wait Jacob let me tell you the rules about this old barn so today Jacob wants to explore because we didn't get to explore the first night whoa this is a good barn wow what do you think of it scary scary but I want to check the one oh. Every time I come here, I bring I more to, stuff. I wanted to check the one that had here, give me that thing. I wanted to check the one that had the upstairs thing. I want to check upstairs. This is the upstairs. Really? Yeah. So, Jacob found a door, a ladder. Come on over here and let's look. When we were downstairs, the first night after we did show prep, we came out and we wait, explored wait, wait. a little. Wait, can you open that? Yeah, open it. What's under? Jacob found a staircase in the old barn, in the horse barn. That's where it leads to. And this is where it leads to. Uh oh, don't drop it on Ellie. Ooh, imagine a dog jumps down there. Yeah, no, let's not Bye. imagine that. Can I close it? 
Uh, yeah, but just don't. Okay, go ahead. Yep. Watch out, Molly. Good job, Jacob. What? Okay, good job. Yep, fun. So, so when we're down there, we're under the grass? Yeah, when we're down in the horse barn, we're under the grass. Wait, what's in there? Okay, wait, watch where you're walking. We gotta go slow because if anybody falls through this barn, it's not gonna be you. You wanna go up and look on the top? Yeah. All right, come on. So this over here is another special door and you open it and you throw hay down. Look, it goes into that barn too. Do you see? Yep. Ellie's like, I'll go down. Don't go down, Ellie. Okay. She's saying. Yeah, she's saying I'll be a little heavy piece of hay. I thought you were saying you'll be a little piece of hay. And yeah. I was like, wait, what? No. <laughs> Poof! <laughs> Brooklyn jumps down the chute. Don't put your hands on me. Oh, I'm like... putting my hands on you, dude, because I, this ladder is old. Is old. We're now. Yeah. Ian. Yeah, go ahead. Do you want to go back in the house? Do you want to go back in the house? Yeah. Okay, go ahead, because you're getting oh, eaten. Man. I have bug spray yeah. in the house if you want to get some. Our. Oh adventures might be cut short because the weather is horrible. Okay, Jacob, that's as far as you can go. Because this... No, 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 no. <laughs> because I can see this ladder caving under your weight. It's not a good ladder. Even Gabby has never climbed that high before. But you're brave and adventurous. I love that. Did you see anything exciting up there? Yeah, just a big daddy long legs. Oh, big daddy long legs. Just what I wanted to know. So in the olden days, this is what we, you would call the hay barn. This is where they put the hay. Wait, was this a back in the day barn? Yeah, it's a back in the day barn. It's an old barn. How old? Like a hundred thousand years? Maybe. Oh, look, there's a better ladder right there. Can we use and there's another ladder over there. There's a lot can of ladders. This is the ladder barn. Can we use this one? See these like pieces of wood right here? Yeah. There's a couple of them. There's like, Ruby, get over here. There's hardly any floor underneath that. Last night, we got home from the horse show. It was insane, like absolutely insane. It was, we had supper. Sam went and got pizza. We had a pizza party at 10 p.m. because it was, I was exhausted. I just had to roll over and go to sleep. I didn't even know what happened after. Like, I was so tired. I was so grouchy, so tired. It was such a long day. We were at the horse show for 12 and a half hours. And before I could do anything, I had to go put the chickens in so they didn't get killed. I had to go lock them in. I went out there to put the chickens in. I got locked in the chicken coop because Ellie jumped on the door. I'm super careful. Ellie jumps on the door and locks me in. Ellie, stop pushing me over. I've been holding on, I want to let you go. Cause every time I try, you find a loophole. I've been slamming the door and just leave you. How was it up there? Pretty sketchy. Pretty Wait, sketchy. Can I, bring, can I bring the camera up? I promise I won't drop it from there. Sure, do you guys want to see? Yeah. I love to see Jacob using problem solving skills. He figured out for himself that it wasn't a good idea. Oh, give me this. Okay. Look up there. Here, hold the camera with two hands, I got you. Okay, look what's up there. See the four down? Pretty sketchy. The newest thing in this whole entire barn is this gorgeous door. <laughs> door latch, I like it. I listen, listen. Do you hear that? What? That's the sound of Nona working. It's my favorite sound. All right, come on, Ruby. Can I show them some other stuff? Sure, Jacob is addicted to showing you the farm. He's been wandering around looking at stuff, just really interested in figuring it all out. But Nono, which is grandpa, in Italian bought him some really fun toys that he's anxious to play with in a sand pile too. Oh, so Sam is working on the barn <laughs> and our goal is to bring everything over this week <laughs> for sure now. Um, I found a bunch of ladders. This is the farm of ladders, of gates, and of wood. There's so much ladder, gates, and wood. Oh, he put the toys, he put the toys in that for you? I'm gonna use it in there because it's dry. Figure out where this water's coming from. Where? This is our oh, cistern. This is, this is our cistern. So it's like overflowing. Yes, I love an overflowing cistern. It means we get lots of water. That means we have to 
Use it. <laughs> yeah. Wow, so we need to start using the water. How do we use the water in here? That pump outside is the water. Oh. Oh, all right. Well, I can use water. I'm good at wasting water. So Molly is obsessed with yeah. Jacob. She has, she's his biggest fan, has always loved him. I think she loves him even more than she loves her owner. Oh, she's like, look at that. <laughs> so Sam bought these really fun. Those are, oh, backwards. Upside bigger down. toys. I don't know what you call them. And wow. we brought them out so that he could play. He got them so that Jacob could play when he's here. You can help build the barn, Jacob. You can dig and move the sand. I found some rope in the other thing, and hopefully it's not too thick. I think it's going to be too thick. I need to set up a rope in the chicken coop because every one of us gets caught out there. I told you that Ellie jumped on the gate and locked me in last night. Sam went to get pizza. The kids were all in the house. It was pouring rain. I'm like, oh my god, I, I didn't have my phone. I thought I was locked in forever. Like, and I just started screaming because I was hoping, it was just when we first got home, I was hoping somebody was still outside. Jacob heard me, he came to save me. But then this morning, I get a message from Sophie and she's like, can you come outside? I'm locked in chicken coop. So we've been locked in our fair share of times. Not to mention being locked in, but I always have to leave the door open when we're in there and the rooster's gotten out two times. He's like, I'm getting out of this joint, so. I need to fix that. Joint. You smoking a joint right now? Um, no. That's a, we don't do drugs in this family. So if anybody missed it, that's our sump. That's our water. I don't know. It's that's where all the water is for the barn, and it's leaking because there's so much rain. Yeah, it's full. It's full. So it like we need leaks. to use it. Yeah. yeah. How come the water, the cement, isn't wet? So the cistern, man. It's a cistern. That's the cistern for the barn, and it leaks. Well, it leaks it here because this is where. <laughs> Probably. See, because I noticed it after looking at this. It leaks because it's over full. Yeah. Because of all the rain. All right, let's go. Come on. So those are the baby chickens that we put with the big chickens when we moved here. They all just kind of hang out back there. And I feed them in another bucket back there. But they're so funny. They're getting braver and braver. Be prepared. I did this all myself and I'm not a, I'm not a building stuff kind of person. That was a very important thing that needed to be done. Jacob and I came to help No No put the horses out. It was pouring rain all morning, so we left them in the in this field out here. I don't want anybody to get confused. We didn't leave them in stalls. We left them in the field where they could go in and out. They choose. Well, hello, handsome. Anyway, we came to put the horses out cuz the rain has stopped. When we were doing a show prep Friday night, all of a sudden our cat came back. Our cat that we haven't seen in two months yeah, just came flying in. All drunk and then now he won it. Yeah. Wait, what? What was that? <laughs> you took all this junk. He said to me, he said to me, look at all this junk. That's what Nana calls it. And I said, it's only junk until Nana wants Nana. something out of there and then it's not junk look. anymore. So we got this live trap and we are going to bait it uh, with something boy. super smelly. And something super good. Tuna. Tuna. We brought Can you give me that? tuna. Yeah. Because it's, I mean, we could have. one? Yeah. It's fish. It's fish. I love Everybody likes fish. I like tuna sandwiches. I do too. Yeah, so I much. like. You like it? I like seaweed. You do? Uh, because I eat, um, what do you call you it? Like sushi? Yeah, I like sushi. All right, so you throw it in the back there. Hmm. And then we're going to catch our cat. Hopefully. We don't catch a skunk. Yeah, we've yeah. done that before. Three. Three? Three's a lucky number. Three's a lucky number? Okay. We're, so, we have the scary house now. We're going to the scary house. So this house has enough room in it that I could set up another laptop in here so that Brooklyn can play. This is my laptop. Do you like it? Anyway, so she gets to play video games with the big girls. So we put the duck and the goose together. Like our plan was for the duck and the goose to be close. Hey Zo! Hey Zozo! Hi honey! Hi! 
Hi, Zoe. I missed my goose yesterday at the show. Like, I just hated that she wouldn't, didn't have us there. Did you take them for a swim? Do you want to take them for a swim before I have to go edit? You have to edit again. Oh, I have a lot of editing. I want to show them your amazing, your amazing show. Your, like, shocking show. Do you know what Brandon said to me? No. Because Brandon didn't coach you. And he came up to me and said, Sophie did really well. Wow. Her and Storm looked really good. Hi, Zoe. Hi, Zoe. Hey, Zoe. Come here, baby. Come here. You can see where Come she's on. Get fuzzy feathers. Yeah, why is she getting fuzzy feathers? Because that's kind of goose she is. So, see how she's got the curls on the bottom? I don't know what that's going to mean, but she's part Episcopal. I think it's Episcopal. It's Episcopal or something. She's part Episcopal. It is late at night, you guys, and we are headed over to the barn. We brought something special. I'll show you when we get to the barn. All right. Go quick. Make sure. Quick, go. All right. We're, ooh, a bug. Wow. Hopefully you can't get out. So basically we caught the cat. <laughs> How'd you catch him? Um, we brought a barrel over there and then Gabby climbed up. Oh, so it's just on the top of the barn? Yes. Oh, there he is. Oh, he's here. Come here. He's not like super friendly. Come here. Because. He just doesn't like being on the ground with us. He's wild and he hates the cat, oh, yeah. the dogs. So the dogs are not going to be able to, on, the dogs aren't going to be able to be out here with him. Like we're not going to, we Gabby, Sophie, we can't come through this way. Yes, I know. For days. Hi, babe. Here's that, my kitten. Let's check him over. We haven't seen you in two, two months. Yeah. Oh, hi. So I'm a little nervous bringing him home. Like he's happy to be with us though. Because we have a baby goose and a baby duck. <laughs> Yeah. I mean, like Why is he so other... friendly? He's like, it's been forever since I've been pet. I'm gonna flea treat him tomorrow and give him his worm medicine. Or his... look how cute he is. Hi. What if he was like? Was he always have these gray hairs? Hopefully, we didn't catch the wrong cat. No, this is this is this Ollie. is Ollie. I know. Ollie. Let's go sit down with him. Hi, kitten. <laughs> We're like squished together on the little couch. Hi, huh, baby. Oh, maybe like, maybe he went someplace else. Oh, maybe he was in that drawer, that cupboard thing. No, he's he's looking still really healthy, oh, nice and chunky. There. He's got well, a lot he of fur. Stuff. Yeah. He was. Where did Dad put his food? It's up on that table. Up on that table. I want to show him his bed. The ma the most cautious cats live the longest. So we brought a little bed for him. I don't think maybe we should put it on the couch. He's not used to beds. Yeah, and we gave him some food. He, he ate that all in one Where's second. his other food? Oh, we should pour him some food. Uh, where's his food and water? Here, Addy. Oh, good boy. Say, ooh, more food. I'm so glad he came back. We literally did not see him for two months and then all of a sudden he just came back. Like that was so fluky. Anyway, we wouldn't have, we set a live trap for him today to try and catch him and then we ended up not eating it because we caught him um, with our hands. But we would, have set, a, happy, we would have set a live trap and just kept going back for him. So we gotta get water. Anyway, we, we brought him a little dog bed Hopefully he'll sleep in it, but he can sleep on the couch too. So we're gonna leave him locked in here for the next probably, Three hopefully weeks. two weeks. That's what we did when we first oh, got the weeks. cats. Yeah, two weeks, Hi, which Ollie. is gonna make it awkward because we're not gonna be able to walk in. Well, we could come in, but the dogs and the cat, the dogs and the goose and the duck can't come through the the tack room, and we're gonna be moving stuff in. So I don't know how that's gonna work. The only thing I'm really worried about is there's six cats across the road and he's going to wander. And I don't want him to get beat up by other cats. I get you. Aww, what a cutie.
手。